Hi, I'm going to show you how to merge and split columns in Power BI. What we're going to be working with today is a Google Analytics data set. This data set has our hits and sessions broken down by source and medium. The first thing I want to do is get a date. And a lot of times when you export from a analytics platform, you may have the, the day and the month and the year column separate. And this is the case here. So what I want to do is create a date format where it's month, day, and then year. What I'm, the first thing I'm going to have to do is reorder the columns because right now day is first, then we have month, and then we have year. To reorder columns, you simply highlight the column and pull it into the section where you want it to be reordered. So now we have month, day, and year. And to merge these columns into one, I simply highlight all columns, right click, go to merge columns. We want to be able to separate these using a separator. We can use any of the, the separators here. However, I like to have a slash in my date. So I'm going to put a slash and then I'm going to rename the column date and then hit OK. We have our new date column. However, we need to change the data type. So go up to the top, hover over the icon ABC, click it, go to date. And we know we this is just a date. We click it and now we have a date column and all of these steps are recorded on our applied steps. The next thing we want to do is split this column because we have source and median together, but I may want to do analysis on source and then do analysis on the median. To split the column, simply highlight the column, go over to your home ribbon, and you can see split column you can click the carrot and it says split by delimiter. The thing that is that is separating these columns is a slash. So we can go by delimiter and we can indicate that we want this split by slash. And I didn't have to put it in because Power BI was able to see that. I click OK. And now we have these split into source and median and of course we can rename these that's splitting and merging columns in power bi i hope that helps thank you